Hello there, friends. Well, today I'm going to show you what not to do when you're upholstering a seat. So what I have here is a seat that my competition reupholstered. So the customer went to go and pick up his seats and then he couldn't stand them. So he brought them to me. So in case if you see me looking at it this way, it's because I'm looking at the seat here in the camera. But anyway, should be looking at you. But anyway, you know, I don't really like to rip on other people's uh, work. And I, I try not to make that a practice. But when somebody brings something like this to me, that means I have to fix it. So I get to see what I, all the different things I need to fix. So let's check them out. So I'm just going to go through these items really quick. So I think the first thing you'll probably notice are the wrinkles. Uh, that's because there's the absence of quarter inch foam or even half inch foam behind the vinyl which makes all this and then all the patterns are wrong really you'll notice the gap between the backrest and the bottom cushion those are some of the other things and um, on top of that some of the other things is stuff details like the welt right here Okay, this is what not to do okay I'm not showing you how to do something here I'm trying to show you what not to do so we don't want to do these things some of the other items on this upholstered seat is going to be the way the welt was sewn you see I'm trying to get the focus right here on the welt let's do that so you can see the stitching on the welt which you're not supposed to be seeing and Right here, you can see where the welt is like a half inch away from the seat. Don't do that. So, let's see, what else do I see on this? Maybe you see some things here. And you can comment in the video what you see. For me... I'm seeing so many different things. So many different things. Things that we don't want our customers to see. Okay? Because what happens if you put out work like this? Oh, you can see right here where there's holes in the vinyl. Where they took it apart right here. There's a bunch of holes in the vinyl. So remember, you don't want to do this kind of work because if you do this kind of work, your name is going to be attached to that. And people are going to know who did the work. And then they might tell somebody that you did it. And you don't want that. So don't do it. So what we have here is before and after. Do you see the difference there? So it turns out to be that the new seat, the one on the right with the darker tan, that's the correct color. For some reason she did this light yellowish tan instead of the correct color tannish brown so we went back to the original vinyl and i had to alter any kind of patterns to actually it wasn't really an alteration it was more of a fabrication i had to fabricate new patterns so that we can get the correct fit on everything so my friends don't let this happen to you. Don't be the guy on the left. Okay? Be the guy on the right. Well, my friends, so don't let this happen to you. So, now you know the difference and let this be a lesson that I hope that you could take with you for the rest of your life. 
Till next time, we'll see ya.